broken son contacted 10 on your side because someone stole the brass vase from his parents grave. Well, he says his family is not the only victim at the cemetery. We don't know if others filed police reports because Portsmouth police have not responded to our repeated attempts to find out today. But just one case is one too many when it hits this close to someone's heart. Evergreen Memorial is a small plot of land, but it's home for Barry Gartman's parents. Oh, I'm there probably every other month or so. I put out flags for all the all the occasions. He also put out flowers until he went by this week and noticed. Uh, the vase was gone and they took my flowers and stuck them in the hole. It was nice of them. He found out he's not the only victim. A woman told him three vases are missing from her relatives' graves. It would appear to be the work of copper thieves. We checked with the company that sells the vases and learned they're mostly copper. Local scrap metal yards quoted us $2.60 per pound. The vase cost $350 to replace. The money's not the big deal. It's somebody going there and destroying something at a grave site. They ought to be shot. A Chesapeake judge sentenced these two for stealing 70 vases from another cemetery last year. Michael Cardona got four years in prison. His ex-girlfriend got 30 days. After their stealing spree, Metal Yards started asking for letters from cemeteries or manufacturers saying it's okay to sell a vase. But Gartman's father taught him, where there's a will, people always find a way. Only his dad did it with dignity. So my father and a couple of men built the seventh cottage at, at Sand Bridge. And Years later, he sold it so I could get this. That's my ring from Virginia Tech. Ralph Gartman sold the cottage he built to give his son an education. How do you, how do you, repay, how do you repay that? By fighting for them. And Gartman won't rest until the person who defiled their graves gets caught. Now, I tried to contact the cemetery to ask about security and fencing, I was told, was recently taken down, but I was unable to reach them. I did talk to Og Stoneworks, though, and they told me that they are able to get a replacement for Mr. Gartman at half price.